Tall stalks of sugarcane have been a part of the South Louisiana landscape since the 1700s. This crop has survived all these years, and the industry has thrived because of the efforts of the LSU Ag Center's Sugar Research Station. Dedicated to sugarcane variety development and management, the station has helped farmers produce more sugar on fewer acres. Researchers at the station work with the U.S. Department of Agriculture and the American Sugarcane League to improve varieties, which help farmers stay on top of pest problems. Diseases and insects uh, sometimes can overcome uh, the resistance of a variety. Those are dynamic, you know, biological pests, and they're not going to roll over and play dead if we breed for resistance. It takes 12 years to develop a variety. Breeders can create hundreds of thousands of seeds in a year while searching for the next promising one. It's extremely important to have a volume of material to work with so you can find that one needle in the haystack. Breeders also are working on energy cane high fiber varieties that could be used as feedstock for ethanol production. Entomologist, plant pathologist, and weed and soil scientists conduct research at the station, keeping insects like the sugarcane borer and diseases such as rust from overwhelming the crop. Sugar production has been a tradition in Louisiana for centuries. With its research and development efforts, the Sugar Research Station is keeping that tradition alive.